Welcome back to Barnes Basics and in this video I wanted to consider what happens in your gas tank. This is octane CH8H18 -H -C -H mixed with, with oxygen. A little bit of spark gets carbon dioxide, water, and energy. This is the energy that is used to drive the pistons in your vehicle and turn the camshaft and get your car down the, down the road to motorize your vehicle. So when I look at this formula, once again, I see elemental oxygen, carbon dioxide, water. I'm going to automatically put those as neutral. In organic compounds, I don't try to reconcile the oxidation numbers in those, so I'm going to just <clears throat> leave that alone. When I attempt to balance the equation, however, I look that there are eight carbons on the left, and I see one here. So my coefficient of eight is the first thing I'm going to spring for. And let's see what this does for us. We have eight carbons and eight carbons, and we have eight times two is 16. We have 17 oxygens and two over on the left. Now, one of the things that I've tried to talk to you about is leave this one till last. Try to reconcile the other, other numbers first and leave the oxygen until last. So in this equation, there are eight hydrogens on the left, 18, excuse me. And so to get 18 on the right, we could put a nine here. Nine times two is 18. That reconciles that. Now we have a peculiar dilemma. We have eight times two is 16 plus nine. We have 25 oxygens on this side over here. I have two here. The way I want to teach you to do this is to kind of, we're going to tweak it just a little bit, play with it. I want you to put 12.5 on this side. So if we multiplied 2 multiplied by 12.5, we would get 25. In a balance of chemical equations, equation though we deal with whole numbers, we do not deal with fractions of numbers. So here is what I would like to urge you to think about doing. I would like you to double every number in this equation and thus balance it. Right now we have eight carbons, eight carbons. We have 18 hydrogens, eight, uh, excuse me, nine times two is 18. 12 and a half times two is 25 oxygens. We have eight times two is 16 plus nine, that's 25. So I want you just to double everything. So let's take this same equation one more time. C8H18 plus oxygen yields CO2 plus water plus energy and let's just double everything so in this case we're going to put a 2 in front of the octane let's double that to 25 let's put a 25 here let's put a 16 here and let's put an 18 here now remember, in chemical equations, we try to get everything to the least common multiple. And in this case, 2 could divide into 16 and 18, but it won't divide into 25 for a whole number. So this is looking pretty good. Let's just reconcile it one last time. I see 2 times 8. I see 16 carbons. I see 16 carbons. I see 2 times 18, I see 36 hydrogens. I see 36 hydrogens. I see 25, I see 50 oxygens. 16 times two is 32, added to 18 is 50. Bam! I think we got it. Marvelous explosion of integer. I can't even spell energy. Loverly. That's what I want to say here. Loverly.